Euralia, a prosperous land, home to many tribes. The gods entrusted the bird tribes to watch over the others. The tribe founded Pegaria, and all lived in harmony under the banner of the Pegarian Empire. Until seven years ago, when Pegaria began recruiting the dog and cat tribes. As their strength grew, the other tribes suffered. To protect themselves from Pegarian oppression, the scattered rodent and bear tribes formed an alliance, led by a rebel named Ratika. Tonight, the Pegarian Empire launches a brutal assault on the Rodentian capital under orders of Emperor Rindrick. When the capital falls, his conquest of Euralia will be complete. And far from the front lines, one who could have brought peace, the godless priestess Vera, has been murdered. In her absence, there is no one left to protect Euralia and its people. The end times are near. Euralia needs a savior. Emperor warned us about Redemption's sorcery. Kill the intruder, quick! But sir, that glow, that sword, is it the Harbinger? What? You think it's the end of the world? Do you see any floods? Any earthquakes? No, sir. But the elders, they say the Harbinger comes to prevent the end of the world, not cause it. Could be the Harbinger, or a retention sorcerer. I'm not taking any chances. This fighter is dead! Catch! Ludomir? You, you killed Ludomir? Your friend thought he could storm in and kill Emperor Injigal by himself. I can tell you this. He met the Emperor all right. And when he did, well, your friend's death was slow and painful. You're sick, just like your master. And where's your Emperor now, anyway, huh? Sacred to show up for battle? Oh, don't you worry. Indrik is coming. And he's more powerful now than you can ever imagine. But you will not get to bask in his light. For Odensha! What is that thing, sir? The retention to toying with dark magic. Attack! <laughs>
right, sister. Indrek! I will smash your precious temple to bits if you don't come out! We are all in danger. The threat. Do you know what it is? Did you investigate the godless priestess? That look in your eyes. You have never heard of the priestess. Mm. Where to begin? Ever since the first godless priestess appeared, the world has been a safer place. As if she scares the darkness away. But now the priestess is dead. Murdered? I am certain this is what has brought you here. Her murder is a sign of great danger. Ah, I only wish... I had more time. I should have seen it. has returned to devour the world. The Harbinger, awakened to fight this threat, learned of the godless priestess, of her role in protecting Euralia, and of her murder. But this was no simple murder. The immortal soul of the priestess always returns to the world. Always. But not this time. Vodun's return was planned. The world has ended, but there is yet a flicker of hope. Harbinger, focus on my voice. Let me help. So I can summon you here. Thank the gods. Do you know who I am? And you did not inherit your predecessor's memories. We have no time to worry about that. Know that you are the Harbinger. 
You are the eyes of Euralia. You are its sword. And you are the only hope we have left. When Voden is done devouring the world, he will find this place. No, he is already searching for it. And when he finds it, well, well, fighting Voden is now impossible. Too strong. Even if you are victorious, there is not much of a world left to save. Harbinger, I brought you here for a reason. There is a way to save Euralia, but it will not be easy. I cannot force you to accept. But if you are willing, then come to me. Thank you, Harbinger. The Tree of Life. There is ancient power here, one that transcends the bonds of space and time. That power can send you into the past. You will have a chance to investigate the death of the godless priestess. If you find her soul, then the Tree of Life can spin it back to Euralia, and that may be enough to prevent Vodin from appearing in the first place. And we have a suspect, Emperor Indric. You saw his war. There is no end to his ambition and cruelty. He may even be mad enough to unleash Vodin, and that means murdering the godless priestess and hiding her soul. The souls you bonded with, the tree can latch onto them, send you to the dawn of their last day. There is Ludomir who died at the hands of the Emperor. If you meet Ludomir before his death, if you follow him, you will find Indrik. Then there is Draga, who seems to understand the stakes. She may help your investigation in a way no one else can. Investigate the Emperor and the death of the godless priestess. Find her soul. But which lead will you follow? Draga or Ludomir? Make your choice. Stop voting. Find it. Ludomir? 
Listen to me. They will cut you down before you reach the gates. And what do you suggest? Wait for it to be over? Yeah, everything will be tickety-boo. At least bring a squad along. Who, eh? Rattica's mob. Everyone's up their ass with the big fight. Besides, they'll just get in the way. Nah, I'll kill the Emperor on my own. You mean, die trying. You better pay your tab before you go. All of it. Yeah, yeah. Just pour me another, will ya? That seat's taken, mate. Ludimir, that's... It's the Harbinger. Ha! <laughs> Harbinger, my ass. Except... Well, she matches the storybook pictures. Sort of. Ludimir! <laughs> Harbinger. Please forgive him. Yeah, he doesn't... Well, if you are the Harbinger, what are you here for? Taking in the sights? Before Rodentia's rubble, I suppose. What's that look for? I didn't cause this mess. <laughs> Thank Hendrik for that. Well, as much fun as this chat has been, I'm off. Big day. The Harbinger. Here. This will be interesting. Tagging along, eh? You know it's a suicide mission, right? Why are we stuck here, sir? We'll miss the battle. Our job here is critical. No one is to disturb the Emperor. Most Imperials believe their leader is in Rodentia right now. What with the invasion and all, Indrik went to a lot of effort to fool his subjects to keep his secret. But I know better. Whatever he's plotting here must be huge. Anyway, doesn't really matter to me. I'm here for one thing only. To make him answer for what he did.
Save your strength for real threats, mate. Lousy construction, eh? Monsters, psychics they call them. There's more of them every day. They just pop in and kill everything on sight. Who taught you to fuck like that? Nice done. My dad was the one who taught me. The stubborn old bear. If it had been up to my mum, I'd be river fishing day in and day out. Construction, eh? Did you feed on Ember or something?
Did I mention how these monsters attack anyone on site? What? Sir, wait for my order. Let them weaken each other. Maybe later. Keep the pressure on. Now, finish them off. Something? Melindrick's stinky feathers. This is the way. They say you show up when the world is about to end or something. That can't be right, can it? It's Sindrick. He's done something. That's why you're here. That bastard. Turn back, intruders. In the name of Emperor Indrick, I command No, just shut up and fight. I could learn a thing or two from you. Noticed all those locked doors we passed. Fancy mystical seals. And this one? This door is special. It's where all the emperors are buried. Think of all the secrets they took with them. Still, unless you're close to Indrik, there's no getting through.
man back in his prime. We're very close now, Knight. I can smell. Huh. Udric's scent just changed. Sulfur? Cinder? I wonder what that means. Intruders! You've got guts making it this far. I will enjoy turning you to ash. Guards must be dead then. I can always trust in you to blindly charge in without. And who's that with you? Ah, uh, don't worry your feathers over it, Emperor. I'm here to end you. Uh, it had to come to this. I once saw greatness in you, but I did not press hard enough. All right, let's hit him hard, mate. I am sorry that Ludimir pulled you into his foolishness, mate. Now you'll both die. Hey! Injury! Got a broom? Don't you dare, Ludimir. You've no idea of the harm. No! That's our cue, mate. Run! You look upset, mate. What? Did you want to chat with our late Emperor? Have a spot of tea, maybe? Trust me, the only conversation we have with you is if you were in chains with a hot iron in your eye. <laughs> May have overdone it a little bit. Smash it all. Now that the construction, I don't get all the fuss about the bridges taking time to build. Upset, mate? What? Did you want to chat with our late Emperor? Have a spot of tea, maybe? Mm. Trust me, the only conversation we have with you is if you were in chains with a hot iron in your eye. <laughs> May have overdone it a little bit. Smashing it all. Clowsy construction, eh? Why don't get all the fuss about the bridges taking time to build? Sentient seal? That's odd. There's the exit! I mean, I enjoy dodging collapsing giant stone structures as much as the next bloke, but I wouldn't mind a drink right now.
Where's that bartender? Fjordball, come out here! I'm not dead, which means you're open for business. <sighs> Fine. I'll celebrate with my friend here, Harbinger, or whatever it is you call yourself. You did good back there. I wouldn't have survived on my own, that's for sure. So much for long live the Emperor. More like, may he burn in hell, and the world's better off for it. Never thought I'd live to see Endric gone. After all, he... Ah, I'm blathering on. Your turn, Arbinger. Now that we killed Indrik, is your, uh, mission complete? Did you stop the apoc- If it's not one thing, it's- uh, Once again, the giant snake Voden, avatar of the Great Void, surges forth to devour the world. The chain of events triggered by the death of the godless priestess have played out as they have before. The truth must be found, and Vodin must be stopped. Harbinger. There has to be traces of what the Emperor did to the Priestess. Buried secrets you can unearth. But Indric would protect his secrets with lock and key. That sealed gate you saw in Yarborg's temple. A high-ranked Imperial, like Draga, may hold the key to such a seal. Turn for a... Remember, the tree will give you a blessing.
Diving. Hurry, Harbinger. General, give me two battalions and I shall capture the core for you. I do not doubt it. But those battalions would turn the battlefield into a graveyard. For them, and the Rodentians both, Iontrek's fury is the key for a swift victory. My lady is wise. But what if the fury fails us during the assault? Then we walk. Now, let us review the battle plan once more. Our main army will initiate a frontal assault. We will simultaneously hit the northern and eastern gates. When we do, Emperor Indrik will bring the fury through the rear. Assuming we can trust the source. The Emperor secured the information personally. We will follow the Redentian's secret path through the Dead Forest into the heart of their city. We will seize the core and end their resistance. Intruder! I will protect you with my life, General. Stand down, Captain. If murder was her intent, she would have already struck. No. I've read of this figure. The Harbinger. Harbinger, why do you grace us with your presence? Something must have happened. And you think I can help you? It can't be the war. Must be something spiritual. The murder of the godless priestess. General Dragon! The prison! Riots! Now? Ah, oh, Radica, is that your move? Of course it is. I expect no less from the Rodentian leader. You must have a plan to stop us, and I cannot allow that. And you, Harbinger. A favor given is a favor repaid. Help me with this and I shall aid you in any way I can. Reinforcements? I brought something much better. I will help. Who wants to spill some Imperial blood? Who's in trouble now, eh?
Run, brother, run! You can count on me! Their attack on this prison is madness. Too many losses, even to rescue a leader. No. This is a calculated sacrifice. They must believe Ratika is a game changer. Whenever you are ready, Harbinger. So, Harbinger, is it really the death of the Priestess that has brought you to me? I will do my best to help you. Vera was... She was deeply respected. I would hate to stand by and see the murderer go unpunished. They must be waiting for us to charge headlong. Let us first level the playing field. are writing insults in ancient Pagarian? Who taught them? Ah, such filthy language. And the spelling is all wrong. I will help. Why that explosive is there? If you think it is best. Your uprising almost impressed me. Almost. Now, lower your weapons. Ratika is not worth dying for. Hi, your mighty General Draga. Tell me, General, how do you sleep at night knowing everything your Emperor has done? Or do you enjoy the killing and the torture? I am loyal to Emperor Indrik. Surrender and give me Ratika. Now! Not a chance! Follow me. I have a plan. They do not know about this path. Kill them all! Let 
let Yarvog sort them out. No way! He fights like the Harbinger! Yes, General. There is a rumor about the priestess. Some soldiers say that she was sniffing around Yarbold's temple not long before her death. The rumor goes as far as claiming that she has been caught inside the Emperor's ancestral crypt. <laughs> Nonsense. The crypt is protected by an unbreachable seal. What are we waiting for? I've been thinking. Vera was a fierce advocate for peace with Rodentia, even met with Ratica and her people. Caused quite a diplomatic stir. Perhaps Ratica can tell you more, if she's in an honest mood. Where did you go, little mouse? I was hoping to end the war with minimal bloodshed. No doubt Ratica has slipped away to the forest and joined the enemy forces. Come. It seems we will face her on the battlefield. Trek's fury is up ahead. The Emperor will use it to end the Rodentian revolt, and I must assist His Highness.
How did they sneak up so close to the Fury? I'm so dead. Still no sign of his highness, my lady. What shall we do, General? Call off the attack? It may be our last chance to strike. Soldiers of Pegaria! Our Emperor has placed his faith in us! He believes in our victory. Victory for Pegaria! We are one voice, one nation, one destiny! Pegaria! We march! Secret is in safe hands. Now, welcome aboard the Fury. with your sword. I expect the respite to be brief. We are not alone. Stop! 
Such a fool. I should have seen this. The Amber Core. I would have expected Ratika to make us stand here. Something is wrong. Ratika? I am deathless. I am your end. Will you break or will you bend? Deathless? Have you connected with the void? Stay soft! She's a slippery one!
feel like I only know part of the plan. We have seized the heart of Rodentia. The Amber Core is ours. The enemy army is broken, their leader dead. Deathless. Such a terrible thing to do. Rataka opened a link with the Void. Becoming deathless unhinges your physical and mental limits, but at the cost of your emotions. Perhaps this is what it means to lose your soul. Or perhaps becoming deathless strips your soul of artifice, revealing your true nature. Who knows? We owe this victory to you. I will ask the Emperor to help you find what you seek when he arrives. I wonder what kept His Highness to not march with his army. It is unlike him. What could... By the gods! Once again... The giant snake Voden, avatar of the Great Void, surges forth to devour the world. The chain of events triggered by the death of the godless priestess have played out as they have before. The truth must be found, and Voden must be stopped. Ratika, you now have a connection with her soul, and may return to her last dawn. But can she be trusted? And that seal Draga unlocked? You saw that seal in Yarborg's temple, protecting the Imperial Crypt. And if the rumor is true, the Priestess has been there.
Oh, she's 